Hello and welcome to another episode of How to Facebook. Today is more of a overview of what Facebook have recently done to make their albums, you know, appear a little bit different. There's a few new functions, there's more customi customizability, and apparently the photos are larger. So right after this, we're going to delve right in and see what we can find out. So let's dive right on in. Straight off the bat, you have a bar now along the top. The first one will tell you how many photos there are of you, how many photos you have uploaded altogether, and how many albums those photos are contained within. Uh, there is a new, a more beautiful view of photos. See what's new. We will click on that in just a moment. We just want to take a little bit of a look further on down. So as you might notice now, all of the images are now square. So even though your images are the normal rectangular, you know, sort of a four by three aspect ratio for any photographers out there, or maybe even a 16 by nine, you will notice that they're all square now. Now, when you actually hover over them, it you can like your picture, you can comment it, and it will tell you straight away how many l thumbs up that picture has had. It'll also tell you what album it's in, you can also highlight it and you can edit or remove it. Now this will be the same on any of the photos that you hover over. So let's have a look here and let's see what's new. So to make a photo bigger, click the star in the corner. That was the star that came up in the top right hand corner that I showed you just a moment ago. Uh, again, the edit section is in the top right hand corner. This is where you can edit the location, change date, you can download it, you can change the, the details and description of the picture and all of that sort of thing. And yes, underneath you can like and comment the video. So not really much of an explanation from Facebook. So let's delve in and uh, see what's changed. Well, the actual viewer, sort of light box viewer itself has, doesn't appear to have changed. Uh, let's hit, click on edit and see if we have any new options here. Uh, nope, there doesn't appear to be any new options from the previous version of the light box. So let's go back in here and I'm going to highlight one of these and see what happens. So there we are. We actually have an interactive photo album. So basically I can go along and make any of these ones larger by highlighting them. And it will actually, you know, rearrange the albums for you, which is uh, quite handy. Let's see what happens if I do this one as well. See, I actually quite like this one. So let's see what happens if we click on photos. So I'm going to click on photos. Now, these are photos that you have actually uploaded yourself, or in my case, that I've uploaded. So I'm going to highlight this one. Uh, let's have a look, see what else we have. I'm going to highlight this one here. So yeah, at first at looking at the new layout for Facebook albums, I wasn't overly keen. I'm not a big fan of, you know, cropping off the edges, you know, to make it a square. Um, but now that I've seen the highlight aspect, I'm, I'm slowly coming around. I, I can see how this is uh, slightly more appealing. So with the albums... When you actually hover over an album, it will bring up another image from within that album. Now, this part of it, I am not overly keen on. I don't like the layout of this at all. Um, let me know what you guys think in the description down below. So that is my very quick um, overview of uh, photos on Facebook. This is actually the first time that I've gone through and looked myself. So 
Were there any surprises uh, for you out there? Yes, I'm going to delete that because I don't want it there at all. No, I can't seem to find any other new options other than the layout itself. So you guys, let me know what you think of the new Facebook photo layout. Do you think they're trying to keep up with another social media network? Let me know in the comments down below. Please don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe to my channel on YouTube, James Lawson Smith. You can share this on Facebook. You can message me on Facebook. Again, James Lawson Smith. You can also get me on Twitter at James LS. If you have any questions, fire away whichever social media network you uh, happen to find me on. Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much for watching. And I am now going to cough. <laughs> Bye.